uh, circuit bricks from ngboss.com and today i have a techno g9 which pops up with all different kinds of adverts on the screen full screen adverts that prevent you from using the phone smoothly and the solution is to do a flash a factory reset won't resolve this issue you need to do a stock rom flash so you're gonna need an sp flash tool a techno g9 rom and your mtk usb drivers to be installed on the computer also you need a usb cable to connect your techno g9 to your computer i'm going to go right ahead and extract the g9 software to my desktop and also did i just close it no it's not complete Allow that to extract and then you go ahead and install your USB drivers if you have not already done so. The ROM has been extracted to the desktop. I'm going to run the SP Flash tool as administrator. Remember to run your SP Flash tool as administrator. You can just find it here flash tool.exe. your phone should be charged at least 60 to 70 percent for you to start this process to avoid any interruptions during the flash process With SP Flash tool loaded, click on Scatter Loading and select the folder where your G9 ROM is and select the MT6582 Android Scatter.txt file. You can decide to make customizations if you don't want to flash your preloader or but I suggest you just leave everything as is. So just click on download and then plug your USB cable to your with the phone turned off of course make sure it's turned off and plug your USB cable if your drivers are installed it should be automatically recognized but if not you would have to install your drivers first If you get the PMT changed for ROM error while trying to do this, like I did several times, when the phone is plugged in, PMT change for ROM, it must be downloaded error. Simply change your download only mode to firmware upgrade mode. And do the process all over again. Click the download button and plug your device. And there you go it should be recognized and the flashing or firmware upgrade process is going to begin i'll put the links in the description to where you can download the smart flash tool the g9 firmware and also the usb drivers the links will be in the description if you check it out you allow the flashing process to continue, it's currently at 12% until it gets to 100%. Your phone should reboot and all should be back to new. With the flashing process complete and the tab booted to the home screen, I did the welcome setup area connected to the internet, try to browse and it works just fine without any adverts popping up anymore so i think this fixed the issue with unnecessary ads and applications installing by themselves on the techno g9 so remember the tools you need the sp flash 2 g9 firmware or rom and your usb and drivers to be installed and a usb cable of course so that's this video on techno g9 flashing with sp flash 2 if you have any 
questions, comments, leave them in the description below. My name is Sokil Briggs and this is NG Boss YouTube channel.